Hello everyone and welcome back to my channel. My name is Jada and this is Jada Lee Budgets. On this channel I do weekly cash stuffings, weekly budget with me's, and quarterly sinking fund updates and cash condensing videos. So today we're going to be doing my first cash stuffing for the month of August. Um, we have, or I made 789 for this week, but after gas and my buffer we will be stuffing 744 and that is exactly what we have here. So we will go ahead and get started with my cash envelope, see what we have left, and then restuff. I think we do have some coins in here. Let's grab the coin jar. Empty this out. it for that then we do have money left over let's see what we have oh my everything is all over the place okay decent amount left in groceries we have 10 15 20 21 22 23 24 in groceries left over we'll put that to the side and I'll show you what I'll do with that later fun has a couple of dollars left has one, two, three dollars left. That with the other money. And then miscellaneous also has a couple dollars left. Miscellaneous has three dollars left. So all together, 10, 15, 20, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 30 dollars left over from this past week. So that's pretty good. And then I do have some receipts to scan into my Fetch Rewards app. Um, I use Fetch Rewards to get points for sc scanning my receipts and then I redeem those points for gift cards. If you wanna do that as well, I have a link in my description box below. If you use my code, it starts you off with two or 3,000 points, which equates to two or $3. Um, and then I also get two or 3,000 points, so it helps me out as well. All right, let's go ahead and jump into it. Groceries is gonna be getting 75 this week, and I'm gonna be doing that in 320s, a 10 and a five. 20, 40, 60, 75. 10, 15, 20, 21, 22, 23, 24, 25, 30, 35, 40, 45, 50, 60, 70, 80, 90, 100, 110, 120, 130, 140, 150, 160, 170, 180, and I don't know why I haven't been doing that sooner because that made it so much easier. It saved a lot more time. So I'm actually gonna order groceries tonight and then pick them up tomorrow on my way home from work. Fun is getting 50. That's gonna just be two 20s and a 10, 20, 40, 50. 10, 15, 20, Miscellaneous is going to get its usual $10. And then giving will get its usual 5 Okay, that is it for my wallet. So we'll go ahead and get into my bills and expenses, it is a new month, so I did empty these out to pay off my bills for this month, and we are starting over. So rent is gonna be getting 180, it's gonna be 100 and 420s. 120, 40, 60, 80. That is all it will have since it's the first week of the month. Utilities will be getting 50. And that's just going to be two 20s and a 10. 20, 40, 50. 20, 40, 50. Oops, this 10 is a little bit bent. Okay. Phone will be getting its usual six dollars. And I'll 
will be done paying this off in four months. Car payment is getting 66. That's 20, 40, 65, 66. Um, subscriptions will be getting ten dollars. Should we do this? Too. And this will be going down next month because I did just cancel a subscription that I haven't been using because there's no point in paying it right now. Jim is getting at twenty six. That's twenty five, twenty six. I did take a week off from the gym, so I really need to get back in there. Otherwise, there's no point in paying for this either. Okay, car insurance is going to get 33. 20, 30, 1, 2, 3. Those ones are super crisp. I really like crisp bills. I feel like it's kind of mixed some people don't like really crisp bills because they're harder to count but i really like them personally invisalign is getting 43 it's 20 40 1 2 3 invisalign has honestly been really working for me my teeth weren't really that bad to start with because i've had braces before i just stopped wearing my retainer so they shifted um but man the Invisalign is making me think that my teeth were worse than I thought before because they're looking so much better now. All right, that is it for expenses. So that's $414 in our expenses. That doesn't include the gas and buffer. All right, then we'll get into sinking funds. This is my long-term sinking funds. Travel will be getting 20. So that's 50, 100, 20, 40. I am right now saving up for spending money while we're in Jamaica. We're going to Jamaica in the beginning of December. Emergency is getting $10. So emergency now has 1,000 in the bank. 1, 2, 3, 50, 4, 20, 40, 60, 80, 90, 505. So 1505 in emergency. And then medical is going to get its usual $5. I did just have a dental appointment, so we'll see if I end up getting charged for any of that. Oh, and I found out I have to get my wisdom teeth taken out, so that will probably cost a little bit of money. Um, I don't know if my insurance will cover all of it, so. Medical has 150, 70, 90, 210, 215, 220, 225. Hopefully my insurance covers most of it at least though. Christmas is gonna be getting 15 this week. So it now has 100, 200, 50, 70, 90, 310, 20, 30, 40, 345 in Christmas. Okay, car maintenance is going to be getting $10. So it now has 500 in the bank, 20, 40, 60, 70, 80, 580, 580. Then electronics is going to be getting five. So it now has 20, 40, 5, 55, 65. 65 in electronics. Okay, savings will be getting 15 this week. So it now has 50, 100, 20, 40, 50, 60, 65, 70. 
170 in savings and this is just extra savings because technically all of my sinking funds are savings taxes is not getting anything because i didn't do grubhub but it has 12.73 i didn't want to count it again because nothing has changed in there okay um debt snowball is going to be getting 40 but it is also going to be getting the leftover 10 I had from my wallet, which I'm going to mark right here. So that snowball now has 20, 40, 60, 80, 1, 20, 40, 60, 70, 80, 90. 190 in debt snowball. And as I said um, in some of my previous videos, right now my debt snowball is just paying myself back. Um, some money that I spent I need to pay it back to my buffer alrighty and then short term funds will get the last 70 I did spend quite a bit out of here this past weekend so it will be a lower amount short term funds now has 100 20, 40, 60, 80, 200 20, 40, 60, 80 300, 20, 40, 60, 80 90 95, 400, 5, 10, 15, 20, 25, 26. 426 in short term funds. Okay. Which gives us a total of 4,729. Which I know has gone down. That was kind of expected though because I was expecting some bigger expenses soon. I got my car detailed and then we had people in town. So yes, there was a bit of spending. Okay, so $1 challenge is going to get the ones left over for my wallet, which is one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten dollars Let me fix this. I think that's the most ones I've ever put in here at one time. Um, you will see a $10 bill in there as well because I needed to exchange it. So, yes. And we do not count this. I will count this at the end of the year with you guys. It will be a surprise to us both. Then lastly, I have $5 challenge, which is just going to get the two fives left over from my wallet. Same thing with $5 challenge. I do not count this and we'll count it at the end of the year. Okay. And that is it for today's video. Thank you guys so much for watching. I will see you in my next video, which will be a budget with me for August paycheck number two. I will see you then. Bye.